Today, I'm here to discuss if age matters at all in terms of achievements. Imagine you were 10 years old. What would you be doing? Being a kid, watching TV, playing games, while maybe nibbling some popcorn. That's common, or perhaps a trend nowadays. But friends, I'm here today to emphasize and stress on the value of time. But most importantly, so that age truly doesn't matter when it comes to achieving one's goals or ambitions. Three real things can make us unproductive. However, many of us can fall into this trap and fail to visualize the long-term consequences of wasting time irrationally just because we're young. I remember my dad constantly reminding me that time lost is never found again. So friends, let's put it this way. What would you do if you had the chance to start life again? Surely you wouldn't make the same mistakes as you did before. This discuss to show that if you put your mind to anything, it does not matter how old you are. What's important is to put fire into your desires. And let's not mix up desires with wanting something. The desire keeps the fire burning within you, whereas wanting something leaves your goal lukewarm. In the sense, you can, you can either have it or leave it. So friends, keep the fire of desire burning in you continuously so that you can live your dream. You can achieve whatever you dream and attain whatever you desire. Believe that you possess the ability to achieve. Believe that you are the twinkle that can make you the twinkling star. But most importantly, understand that you will never be able to achieve a dream should you feel age matters. My dad was a vivid example of how age didn't matter. At the age of 48, he did his MSc while juggling numerous other activities on the side. This was a source of my inspiration. It was then brought to my attention that an article released by The Independent said that not all teenagers of today are a bunch of feckless layabouts. And there were many that I could take inspiration from myself. So I thought to myself, if they could do it, why couldn't I? What could stop me? I've always been a firm believer that everything is possible and nothing is impossible. And the word impossible itself denotes, I am possible. I began charting out my own track. I've always had a passion for developing apps. When I discussed this with some of my teachers and my friends, they said, Ruben, you're too young to be building apps. That's when I decided to prove them wrong and chart out my own track, follow my own course in destiny, firing up the desire within me and achieving my dream, and ultimately being the person I always wanted to be. Don't let other people's opinion of you influence you or change the course of your destiny, because I didn't allow that to happen to me. Believe that the destiny is in your hands, and only you are the creator of your own destiny. I began researching into building apps a few months later, and eventually found something called MIT App Inventor. It looked fairly simple to use compared to other complex programming languages. So I decided to give it an attempt, because my passion was always to have an app on the App Store. Eventually, after countless days, every, every day after school, I used to rush from my laptop, finish my, um, even sometimes skipping snacks, and finish the project. And eventually, I developed my first ever app, Quick Notes HD. Um, I then convinced my parents to pay the developer fee. And 24, 24 hours later, it was approved by Google. I remember typing the name of my app on, onto my phone. And seeing it there was just the best feeling ever. I remember going on a family vacation to Goa, where I wanted to balance my time between my passion and holiday. So I decided to enroll into HTML and CSS. And even though this had nothing to do with building apps, it gave me a fundamental understanding of programming. And it eventually led me to develop my first website, which I still use to date. So friends, believe me, if you develop the hunger and are resolute to pursue your goal, you will achieve your dream. I remember when my parents bought me quite a highly spec laptop. It allowed me to create more complex apps. 
with more complex features. It added to my momentum, and the fire of desire was burning in me. Today, I have four apps on the Google Play Store, and initially, I didn't really care about how many downloads it got. I just wanted to release it. But things started to change for me when I realized it went from zero to 10, 10 to 40. And now it has over 1,000 downloads on the Google Play Store. I have two businesses under which I operate, RD and HD and Tech Explained. On RD and HD, I create websites for local SMEs, as well as some well-known YouTubers. On Tech Explained, as the name suggests, I explain the technology behind products and work with numerous companies worldwide. Following on the success of my business, it gained extensive media coverage, which Unfortunately, I couldn't include everything in the presentation. <laughs> Over time, I've realized that life just isn't a bed of roses. But at, <laughs> but at the same time, if you set goals and pursue them and go after them passionately, you will achieve your dream. Going by the words of Mark Twain, age is an issue of mind over matter. If you don't mind, it doesn't matter. The quotes that I always live by, and the quotes I think you should live by as well. Do what you love, and the money will follow. Pursue excellence, and success will follow. To conclude, I would like to say, my aim is not to promote myself, but rather to inspire you to follow your passion and do what you love, because ultimately, that will lead you to success. Thank you.